Welcome to Microsoft Make Code for Minecraft. Today we're going to talk about mobs. This is Pelly. Hi, I'm Guillaume. Richard's here too. Today we want to build a chicken farm. Uh, so we're going to have tons of chickens and keep them nice and tidy into a uh, fence, fence gate. Uh, so Guillaume, you're going to have to figure out how to get a ton of chicken. Yeah, I mean, really a ton. I mean, the game is all about mobs, right? Let's try this. So I'm in my editor now. Um, so there's a mobs category here. That looks promising. Okay, this is what I have available for me. We have more advanced block here. Interesting. So I have a spawn block. This is, this looks like what I want. I will create a chat command that will make monster spawn, or animal in this case. Let's call it, uh, I don't know, chickens. Cool, so it looks like I can select um, oh, you see what the animal to spawn. Interesting. Chicken, it was already selected. Oh, you're building a fence, nice. It should be done by the time we're done, unless I mess up like I'm doing right now. Chicken. Let me try my command. Something did not go right. Oh, I did not type the correct chat command. Chickens. Yay. Chickens. Oh no, it's oh. escaping. Build faster. Wait, wait, wait. Come back here, come back here. I can't push it. That's fine, I can spawn a ton more. Okay, oh, if we want more than one, I can use the repeat block uh, that we used in the previous yeah, video. Let's start with like 100 chicken. 100? You're going to need a bigger, <laughs> bigger fenced area. So I'm bringing a repeat block from the loops category. I'm okay, going I'm to move like my spawn inside. Okay, let's start a reasonable for now. 10 chickens. All right, sounds good. Oh, I can't get out. Whatever, I will have chickens with me, so that's fine. Chickens! Woo! Whoa! <laughs> Ten. Yeah, for now I started. I was oh, cool. reasonable. But they all spawn. Time. They all spawn at the same place. Yeah, can we make them like spawn kind of randomly here and there? So I noticed that I can control where they get spawned. So this is the um, similar position block that we had when we did our mega jump. So we remember that the second coordinate controls uh, the height of the position. So let's. I'll, I'm, I'm going to make the chicken spawn above me. So I'm going to replace this with ten. But that's okay. They fly, so they won't die. Oh, they won't get hurt. We don't want chickens yeah. getting hurt. Okay, let's try this. Chicken. Really nice. We got chickens. Where? Oh, oh yeah! <laughs> fly chickens. Chickens flopping down into what? Woohoo! That's twenty chickens. I don't think we can put it in that, that fence. Yeah, I don't know, it's a lot though. It would be a shame if something happened to them. You know what? Let's try to see how many we can... There you go. I'm starting a rival farm, I think. Um, and, uh, yeah. I'll just take those chickens. Thank you very no! Much. What? You stole the chickens? <laughs> <Our> chickens! <laughs> Did you just teleport all the chickens to you? That's uh, fine, because... cannot confirm or deny that. Um... <laughs> You can keep your 20 chickens because we're going to have a hundred. <laughs> so what happens is... Oh, look at all those chickens flying down. Richard gave oh, rights no, they're to... Escaping. No, Guillaume gave rights to Richard to run some advanced commands. Which was a terrible decision. Which was a terrible decision. No! <laughs> Otherwise, when you're playing Minecraft Education in Network, you can control the agent. You can't really destroy your friend's world. But if you opt them, so how, what command did you use to give Richard the rights to mess around with the chickens? So this, uh, the game has a built-in command, it's a slash command called slash op. op. And I can, using this command, I can give rights to my fellow players. So can you give me right? Yes, I would do slash op and then your name. Oh cool, I, you have been opt. All right, now that's, use these privileges to steal our chickens back. That sounds great. I'm going to free them. <laughs> chickens. 
What? Freedom! I think you might have been a little overzealous with that teleporting there. <laughs> oh no, now um, all the chickens are escaping. Seems like you teleported everything in the world to you. <laughs> yeah, I might have. Oh, look at all these chickens. Oh. <laughs> okay, so let's go back to the code and see what we've learned today. We've learned uh, chat command. We know that. That's, that's really cool. We know that about loops. We can use loops to repeat code. And the new block today in this video is a spawn block. So, Spawning, we can spawn, so I can spawn animals. What else can... Oh... We can spawn <laughs> monsters too. So have a run and go and explore all the stuff that you can spawn. Uh, oh, we can really spawn almost all the monsters. You can try that at... Uh, on the editor. Otherwise, go and check out our movies on our YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you, Guillaume and Richard. Bye, everyone. A creepers run! Mm -hmm.